All right, so as you can see, Epic Games has just started handing out the Beast Brella reward if you competed in yesterday's Mr. Beast Extreme Survival Challenge. So I'm genuinely curious how many of you actually won this. Let me know in the comments right now if you did or if you didn't and also what your score was. So just in case you weren't aware, I did cover this in a video yesterday, but you had to score 85,040 points or more. 85040 or higher in order to get this beast brella. So this is definitely going to be one of the rarest items in the game. There should only be 100,000 people with this in the world. That's it. Now, I guess they didn't really clarify whether or not this is going to come to the item shop, but as far as I know, it's not. It was an exclusive reward for this Mr. Beast challenge. So the real question is, was it worth it? Let's take a look. As you can see, it says, congratulations, you've unlocked this week's reward. I don't know why they said that. It's not a weekly reward. And then on the right, it says you won this Beast branded umbrella in Fortnite. Nice. Pretty cool. So let's go into the locker real quick, take a look at it. I'm pretty sure I have every single unlockable and battle pass umbrella in the game. I'll have to double check, but I'm pretty sure I've won each and every single thing that was absolutely possible. So that is literally the description. It says you won this beast branded umbrella in Fortnite. Interesting. Now the color scheme is orange, pink, blue, and black. And it does say Mr. Beast, obviously. Interesting. So that doesn't really match any of his skin colors, does it? Let's take a look. I can't remember what his skin looks like. So there's no orange at all on the Mr. Beast 6000. By the way, I do have my review coming today. I just finished editing it this morning, so it'll be a full gameplay and review on the entire Mr. Beast bundle. Likewise, on this one, there's no real orange. So that's a surprising color scheme. I wonder why they did that. I know who Mr. Beast is. I've watched tons of his videos, but if anyone knows specifically why this color scheme, let me know in the comments. That's a weird color. I think it's a shade of orange, but I don't know. I mean, this is orange right here. That is orange. It's like an off shade of orange, I guess. Well, I'm going to run it on my Maya skin just because it's my favorite skin in the game. So we'll hop into a real match. We'll check this out real quick. All right, here we go. The Beast Brella. Well, that didn't make any noise at all, did it? Let's do it again. There we go. So it's just the normal umbrella noise, yeah. You can clearly see the Mr. Beast name on there. How about the underside? Yeah, seems like an okay glider. How about a contrail? No, nothing. Backwards. Left. And right. So it's not the best. I'll be 100% honest. There's nothing really unique about it other than the brand logo on there. Color scheme looks good, though. Just kind of strange. They didn't do any sort of contrail. No special effects or anything. It's just a nice looking glider. But other than that, you didn't really miss out on much. No unique noise when you deploy it. I thought for sure money would just fly out of this or something like that. But there is nothing unique about this other than the Mr. Beast name on it and the color scheme. And the fact that only 100,000 people get it in the entire world. So it's super rare, but in terms of actual rarity of the glider, it's just a normal looking glider, in my opinion. So I wouldn't be too mad if you missed out on it. But then again, if you're a collector of all rare things in the game, yeah, you might be a little upset that you didn't get it. I guess it's nice compensation for not winning a million dollars. As you can see, the PlayStation 4 still freezes, by the way. Every time you try to play a match, it just completely freezes. A little frustrating, to say the least. So there you go, one of the rarest gliders in the game. And it turns out it's just your average umbrella. Nothing really unique about it. Just super, super rare. Let me know in the comments, what do you think about it? Do you think it should have done something unique at all? Or do you like it just the way it is? By the way, does anyone know how to make these icon umbrellas go down to the very bottom? Because no matter what I sort by, I can't get them to display all the way down here. This is where all the umbrellas usually go, especially the seasonal Victory Royale ones. 
However, all the icon ones are stuck up at the top and I can't get them to go down here. So that's kind of frustrating. I don't know. Well, regardless, there you go. That's all there is to it. Hopefully, guys, enjoy this video. A like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TaperTime.